Hey, what's up? This is Adam Ta here from AttractingMarket.com. Uh, that website's launching very soon, but for now, welcome to a great tutorial on my blog here. And here's what we're going to be doing: we're going to be learning how to upload a PDF file on Blogger, and you can do this on WordPress as well, and be able to preview this as well. You know, people can see it, and they can, you know, turn to different pages. And not only that, they can, you know, zoom in and out. And there's an option as well where you can leave a link and they can go and download it, so, you know, as well as uh, you can make it full screen. So let's look at how we can do this. And it's very easy, very simple steps. You just need to get upload it and get a code and we'll paste it in. So let's start and uh, make it happen. Okay, I've got the Word document. I'm just going to go to Google and I'm going to type in inscribed. Click on there. Right, so we need to log in, create a free account, it is free, and I'm going to put my details here. Right, so this is where I am. The first thing you need to do is the upload button, so click on here. Right, and then choose your file, very simple. I've got the file here, the Word documents, it open. Uh, that's done, and you can check this box, I agree, I understand, so on. Okay, you can make it private if you want. Okay, or, um, or mark it private, or just leave it as it is. You want it open for everybody to read. So I upload this document. It's doing it really fast. The next step is, and this is very important to to have a description on here, and not just put, not put loads of keywords on, you know, like crazy. Really give a good description. You know, provide value. Now I've done this already uh, on the notepad, so I'll look at this, and I'll I'll take the description that I've got here. done I've got the title here how to so I'll, I'll change the title here okay how to convert prospects into customers that's the the transcript that's the interview on here and then I'm gonna take the tags that I've got I'm going to put it on here now you can put business you can put creative writing how to guide I'm gonna put how to guide the manuals okay so let's put that that's done again if you want to make it private you can do so and you save now you can put an email here and to, of people you know who are maybe already on your list or whatever and you want to put them there. I won't. I don't really do that. You know, I've got my list and I can email them that way. This is more professional to do it that way. You email them and it's, it's brand new instead of doing it from here. Okay, so that's my tip: is don't don't do it that way and don't email it to anybody that's not on your list that hasn't said raise their hand up and they've opted into your capture page or your blog subscription. Okay. So I won't do that here. I'll just leave it as it is and I'll say, yep, that's fine. Everything's fine. There we go. Now we've got the, the URL out there. And this is the code. you got the, the code here for the WordPress. And this is the code. This is the one that I'm going to be using for the blogger website. So I'm going to copy that. That's done. We're back at our blog. And uh, this is what you see if you're in blogger. So press on uh, new post. And I've got everything ready, you know, uh, sorted everything out. So let's put the first the title. Put that title here. And put that text here. And also this here. And uh, the code, we're going to put it here. So remember that code that we've got. See that code here? To make sure that you're on edit HTML. And I'll paste the code, scope a bit more, and paste it here. Control V to paste. That's sorted. Put your tags there. And what we'll do is uh, preview it. And there we have it. Okay, and if you look, go right down, that uh, you've got, uh, you know, the hyperlinks are there. It's working. If I click on the business blog, for example, the blog. There we go. Okay, it goes back to the blog. So uh, you can also put hyperlinks there, and you know, you know your personal information where they can contact you. Uh, that's what I do, and uh, I have no problems in people and give me a, a buzz on Skype or email me and want more information, and we talk on you know Skype for half an hour, twenty minutes. So and that's the way you build for your network marketing business or any business. Provide the value. Okay, you can read my post where I talk about value because some people say people who provide value don't make money. Well, I'm sorry, but they make a lot more money than you think. All right, it's just that people don't understand what 
what value really means, the de real definition of value. And uh, I'm just going to save this now. I'm not going to post it because what I, what I want to do is edit the video and you can see the video here already. Okay, so uh, you can come back to this post and check it out and see, see for yourself. Uh, I don't know if you need uh, a flash or something on your computer to see this, you know, because sometimes I get people saying that they can't see my audio, but there's many who do see the audio that I put here as well. So, but it works great here, as you can see. All right, so I hope this helped you out. Provide value. Value means the how-to, the solutions that your readers and prospects are really hungry for and they want it now.